Welcome into the ballpark. Happy to have you with us. The show brings you a matchup of division rivals. It's the Texas Rangers and the Los Angeles Angels. And now, first pitch Rangers. coming your way next. Los Angeles Angels. Man at second with one away. Next to hit, Gerald Raymond. Singing, you can't ask for anything more. This guy checks all the boxes offensively. He is the ultimate professional, and it doesn't just start at game time. It starts in the afternoon, the way he prepares and gets ready for the ball game. I tell you what, his teammates feed off of the leadership that he shows on and off the field. The pitch. And there's a foul ball. Well, pretty clear to me, he was trying to go deep right there, but you got to get a pitch that you can handle. Righty to the plate. On the ground, out to short. In plenty of time to first and two away now. Good two-seam action right there, running away from the batter. Gerald Raymond, the next to hit for the Angels. 0 for 1 so far. It's interesting he plays kind of a, a power spot defensively, but runs pretty well. So when you're looking at that position, you're not expecting someone that has maybe above average speed, but he does. And I think that skill set really upgrades the position because when you have that kind of speed, it makes the whole team that much better. He's got it. Here comes the pitch. There goes the runner from first. Hard hit, left side. This looks like extra bases. McCallum doesn't stop heads for home he scores and they lead by two fastball pretty much middle middle and that's what you fall asleep dreaming about as a hitter so no surprise he put a great swing on it man in scoring position with two away and next for LA Alex Levitt Went down on strikes his first time through. The next pitch misses, and yeah, that's ball two. What about him playing another position on defense, one that would require a little more range? Absolutely, and I think if push came to shove where they had to make a, a move during a game, it surprised a lot of people. You might Macias racing over to make the catch. So a run on one hit, no errors, and a man left. On to inning number four. Angels two, and the Rangers nothing. Alfredo Navarro stepping in for the Rangers. Up next for the Rangers. Up on the ground. Let's go this right here. Up. Alfredo Navarro. Hey, we got one. Puts a bunt down. Raymond. On a second, they get one. Throw to first, but he beat it. One down. Gerald Raymond, the next to hit for the Angels. The third baseman, Gerald Raymond. Into center and a base hit. First pitch swing in, went up there with a the plan to be aggressive. That's about as textbook as it gets. Got his stride and load out of the way early. He stayed inside that ball and squared it up out front. Man, that was like he was in the cage hitting off a tee. And you can feel this crowd waking up a bit here as the guys are starting to make some noise with their bats. Here's the Angels catcher, Alex Levin. And the right-hander deals. Runner on the goal. Throw to second. Tag. Out at second. That goes to show you stealing a base. And now it's switch hitting third baseman, Gerald Raymond. Oh, look out here. He's going to come up ready to swing in this situation. Hey, let it fly up there, huh? Swings and lines a base hit into left field. Throw back in quickly. First and second now with nobody out. Seems like he got exactly what he was looking for right there. Anytime you rip a line drive the other way, you feel really good about what you did at the plate. You trusted your hands, you let the ball travel, and you took the barrel straight to it. That's great work right there. Now a huge at-bat in this game coming up. 
Line drive. That's a base hit. Here comes the runner. Here comes the throw. It's off the mark, and he scores. And they trail by one. Well, that at bat had a lot riding on it. Certainly a pivotal swing of the bat in this ball game. Nice job of driving that pitch the other way on a line. You know, hitters, they take so many reps in the cages working on going to the opposite field, and it doesn't always translate into the game, but right there it did, and he did it perfectly. So now it just comes down to situational hitting to get the tying run home. They've got a really great opportunity to do that. Digging in, Ben Luis. So a foul ball makes it one and two. Everyone here understands just how quickly things could change next one just misses the count now two and two here comes a pitch lifted in the air right center field that one hops against the fence and he's safe at third as a run scores on the play Stringing them together, that's three hits in a row. I love the approach he had right there with that pitch. Not trying to do too much, but still looking to drive it, and that's exactly what he's able to do into the opposite field gap for the double. Close one here today, and your final 5-4. For Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB The Show, I'm John Chomby. Thanks for joining us.